here and cope, doing a little bit of shopping. And there's some food I need, but right now I'm in the section for makeup and thinking about getting a new foundation because I'm almost out. And they're all made in, well, some are made in Germany. The foundation I was looking at is made in Poland. <laughs> um, I think I might come back for that because that's not the main thing I need right now. I decided to try manure food because I couldn't really find anything much in Coop. Coop. I keep wanting to call it Coop. There's all the fresh bread. I already bought some for the biscuit. So here's an example of a cost of ice cream. Maybe it depends on what brand, but expensive. It's all expensive. You know where I need to stop though is the chocolate area. Which ones should I buy? There's Reese's for some American chocolate wow. I'll try this one too. Oh look, there's Crunch. Candy chocolate. I think this is made in Germany. There's Frosted Flakes, but it's called Frosties. Just like Honey Snacks is called Snacks. The boxes aren't that big, but they're all $5 each. Like no matter what, they're $5. There's a cool American sour green geschmack. That's so funny. This is the lamp. I actually don't like this kind. It's not a very big bag, but it's almost four Swiss francs. Okay, so this is just something I've noticed in Switzerland, kind of in Germany, but like this Knorr brand seems to be really popular over here for sauces and making gravy and things like that. Like, there's so much of it here. Like, I've never noticed it in the States, but that's just me. Ooh, this is cool. I was wondering, should I get more guacamole sauce? Because I really, really love guacamole. I only have enough to make it like maybe one more time, but I don't know. Happy Focus So one thing about Europe or Switzerland at least is there's no such thing as sour cream. They have something like this. That's about as close to sour cream as you can get. It's so expensive for just one little thing. And for one liter of milk, it's a dollar fifty-five or a dollar sixty-five. Honestly, How did I miss this row? This is where the jelly is and the sweets. Oh my goodness. Oh, oh, there's an apple cellar. But if you notice, no peanut butter. Oh wait, there's one. But guess what, it's crunchy. Liberty Gold. I've never heard of this brand. Also, if you wanna try the local honey, expect the pain about making the spikes. But look at this. This is the jelly that I just helped make a few days ago. Um, and they're selling it here in the grocery store in Cooler. That's so neat. Of course, I always find the American sandwich bread really funny. <laughs> the hamburgers have the American flag on them. That's just too funny. Okay, meat in Switzerland is really expensive. Like, really just outrageous. This is maybe half a pound of ground beef per 10 Swiss francs and 15 cents like 10, 15. It's ridiculous. This is a little piece of steak for 680. Okay, these things are really popular over here. There's some kind of potato and these things as well for Fellini. Italy. That's from Swabia, Germany. That's pretty popular too. So, this is a drink I was talking about, Rivilla, that is only found here in Switzerland. You can't find it anywhere else. It's a very special drink. Oh, 
This looks interesting. Okay, I feel like I made about a billion circles in this store and my arm's killing me from the basket, so I'm gonna go ahead and get out of here. Also, before I spend too much money anyway. Oh, where they go? Should I do self-checkout? Nah. So I'm pretty happy with myself. I only spent about 31 Swiss francs in the grocery store. However, because I bought a couple avocados, I realized I have nothing to eat them with. I'm gonna have to buy some chips or tortillas or something. I also just remembered that I still have to buy postcards too, so there's definitely a few things I need to buy before I leave, but I thought I'd kinda take a break and be in the city. The weather is really nice right now because it's like cloudy and it's just not that hot. It's really nice and I can wear my jacket so I really like this a lot. So I was able to find some postcards. Bought this one. I actually bought two of these. I have this one for the cows and the little Catherine corn. I really like this one. This one is probably my favorite. And then I've ridden the Bernina Express. It's really great train run you see so much i have some car stickers okay so i went to this other coke store and look at this i've never seen this before sweet potato tortilla chips still kind of expensive but i might try to get some um this is a dollar cheaper than what I usually pay. It's not as big of a bag though, so. So I just came back and I'm filming with my camera now instead of with my phone. I just didn't want to film with my big old camera in the grocery store. I just would look kind of awkward and I was like, I'm just gonna use my phone because it's easy to whip in and out and stuff. So anyways, here, here is my bag of groceries and I'm gonna unpack it. I'm gonna see if I can try to set the camera up somewhere that way I can kind of show the food I have. So I kind of already showed a lot of what I bought at the grocery store as I was filming, but I'm just going to kind of run over everything again. The first thing on top is the bread and, well, let me kind of cut out a little bit. So the bread was like 420, which isn't, it's not bad. I've had this bread before. It's really good. I just, well, I thought it was like two something or three something. So when she rang it up, I was like, oh, anyway, bread. I did end up getting the paprika chips. I love these chips so much and I crave them like, I always miss them whenever, um, like I wish we had them in the States, but we don't. And I got them, I got the regular tortilla chips because they were cheaper than the sweet potato ones. I'll get those next time though because I do want to try them. Yeah, let's see. I did get the rusty. It's a lot like hash browns except it fills up the whole pan. This is pre-made. I mean usually they will like shred up their own potatoes and fry it themselves which you can do. And then I have Gruyere cheese. Now this is the one thing that I find is kind of cheap in Switzerland. It's probably because they have so much of it but like this would easily cost like 10, 12 dollars and this was only like three something here. That's, she has funny, and then yeah, I already showed my postcards. I already showed the drinks that I have, the Ritzuner, I hope I say that right, Holland, Hollander Blüte. I guess it's made with some kind of Hollander Blüte, I don't know, it's that flower, um, I guess it grows here in Switzerland, but it says Ein Stück Grabünden, like a piece of Grabünden. I thought, oh cool, like it has a little Capricorn on it. Maybe you saw it. So, I don't know. I thought that was kind of neat. And then I got the same uh, Rivela. I love this drink. I wish that they sold it in the States. But then again, it's kind of cool they don't because it's special over here. Avocados. I was like, where's the other one? <laughs> Couldn't find it. I have two avocados. I am so quite craving. I can't speak right right now. Craving guacamole. Oh, no, my butter melted. Okay, and then I have the... It's Flora Alp. And I got this butter because not only is it like Swiss and it's, well, it's also the cheapest and it's small. I really don't need that much butter. So, yeah. That's the stuff I forgot I had that. Yeah, I bought another pack of guacamole mix. 
Ragusa chocolate, Golden Alps chocolate. I have this chocolate. My battery camera died, so that was kind of random. Avon Maltine. This. I just have. I'm gonna make another video trying all these chocolates. This one's my favorite. So this one's really good. They have other. Bunch, they have so many other types of chocolates. These are just the ones that I bought for now. I am starving though. I'm going to eat my guacamole and chips. All this though costed about. I would say, well, including, yeah, it was about $50 for all of this with the postcards. Postcards were 10 um, the chips were 10 and everything else was 30 give or take. So, yeah, that is my video for grocery shopping today. I hope you all enjoyed it. It's really funny. I wish, gosh, I wish people could be um, with me. Like, I wish they could see it for themselves because it's really quite different. I'm going to fix myself something to eat. I'm really hungry and I'm also just kind of cold so I'm going to like jump in the covers for a while and probably watch a movie or something. I should have bought hot chocolate. <laughs> but yeah, thanks for watching and yeah, I'll see you next time. Alright, I'm here in Golden, Colorado with Jennifer. We're both gonna stand on here with one leg. Da 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 da